Once you activate the compressor, the bike will start to rise after the gauge hits 50 PSI. You'll notice the needle kind of hovers there around 50. Right now the bike is raising up. Once the bike hits full ride height, now the gauge will start to climb again. What you want to do is sit on the seat. Once you add your body weight to the seat, your pressure is going to go up. What that does is helps you um, not bottom out. Once the shock is compressed, the air pressure increases and helps eliminate that bottoming out. You'll also notice that the needle moves every time we hit a bump. That's something that you would have felt before. You'll be able to judge how the bike is riding based on how that needle is moving. If it's short, quick bursts on the needle, that means the suspension can be set a little bit too hard, especially if the needle isn't moving very far. If you've got a good bit of movement out of the needle and it's nice and smooth and fluid-like, that means the suspension is set about right.